Hey guys, Retro Dude here. Thanks for listening to my channel again, where we take a look at all things retro and cool. Today I have an unboxing for you guys. So I think it was early 2021 or late 2020. I pre-ordered this right here. This is a Scott Pilgrim KO edition from Limited Run Games. If you've never heard of Limited Run, they're huge fans of retro gaming. So they took it upon themselves. They built a company around that fact and what they do is they release cool retro nods for games that we know and love mainly retro games by the way now the reason why i decided to order the Scott pilgrim is because the game itself is a huge nod to retro gaming and it was one of the pioneers in doing so nowadays uh, retro gaming is a, there's, a, there's a huge boom with all kinds of retro remasters being released. This one wasn't a retro remaster, it was just a game that, that just said retro games are cool. And they tailored the game around that. I mean, it has huge nods to River City Ransom, one of my all time favorite games, and Double Dragon. It, it's in that vein that this game is made. So, because I love the limited run games, and because I love the game, I figured, you know what? I'll splurge for the KO edition and today I'm going to unbox it for you guys and let me know what you guys think. Alright, let's see what we get with this limited run Scott Pilgrim vs. the World KO edition. First off, we're getting this numbered card and on the back it's limited run. They also give us <laughs> a special discount code for waiting so long to actually get it. And a plastic case. Alright, as you can see, it's actually pretty well packaged so it wouldn't get damaged. Since it is a collectible, you want it to be that secure. First of all, that's how it looks. Let's check it out from the sides. Check it out from the back. From the bottom. And that's how it looks. From the front. All right, let's get crack it. So first this just pops out like that. Remove battery insulation. Remove battery insulation. Pull tab. So I guess they're talking about this one right here. Let's get it open. That's really cool. Let's just 
just open the board down there. It's magnetic. So you can just pull this out. And this comes up. Now let's see what's in there. Has a couple of guitar picks. Three from what I can count. Has a couple of drumsticks. And they have little engravings on them, but check it out. <laughs> See if I can get close enough for them to be able to tell. And the other one. a little bit better. Cool. <laughs> Obviously it comes with the Scott Pilgrim game. Got the Scott Pilgrim game. This I'm gonna keep sealed anyways, since I already have the digital version. We have the soundtrack. You know, I'm a big fan of the soundtracks in video games. We have stickers. And the whole map. <laughs> really cool. Let's see what else we have. We have Scott Pilgrim, complete edition behind the pixels book. That's a nice little hard work right there, look at it. <laughs> Has a little scuff pilgrim right there in the bottom. Well, I'm not gonna go page by page, but has nice little artwork in it. Walk through, so it's like a strategy guide. We got more stuff still. More stickers. Full digital guide, prima. PrimaGames.com <laughs> These guys used to make strategy guides. I remember I got a I got a strategy guide for Tekken 3 from them. Has a pixel pin. Has more cards. Check them out. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, six cards in all. Wow, this is really cool. <laughs> Check it out. Original video game soundtrack cassette. Yeah, this game definitely had a thing for retro gaming, and her cassette definitely lets you know it. This is really cool. I like this. Well, that's it, guys. What do you guys think about this KO edition of Scout Pilgrim from Limited Run Games? I think these guys are great. They're really big fans of retro gaming. Uh, I love Scout Pilgrim because it's one of the first retro gaming nods that that we've had in recent years. The game itself is already pretty old. But that's why I liked it. It was a huge nod to... River City Ransom and Double Dragon. So I'm a big fan of these types of games. Well, that's it for today, guys. If you guys like the content that I'm uploading, uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, hit me with a thumbs up. If you have any comments on anything else that you guys think I should be getting, picking up uh, for retro gamers, uh, go ahead and leave them in the comment section below. Other than that, thanks for watching. And as always, stay retro.